welcome to another edition of our weekly unboxing. Let's uh, get logged in and check it out. It's going to be a pretty quick video today. I pretty much only worked on my death knight this week. Um, kind of had two off nights, so I didn't um, play as much uh, play as much WoW, but. Um, I think I'm going to leave, I think I'm going to leave my loot spec to blood. Try to get a, uh, what is it, the scale from, uh, the other side, I think. So a good tanking trinket. I end up doing a lot of tanking for keys, so I think it makes sense to try to get, um, tank stuff. Of course, my preference would be, you know, to max out my DPS gear, so, you know, a 226 helmet would be good or like a stat shuffle on uh, my belt or my shoulders would be good um, I guess technically a better ring but this one's got a socket so it's kind of kind of equals out in the end but all right let's uh, let's just open it up see what we get the only real difference between switching specs is gonna be uh, trinkets I guess it's kind of weird that that's really all there is. Ooh, shoulders. And a cloak. Ooh, leech. Big leech cloak. <laughs> I guess I, I only did a two key for my tenth key. Um, Alright, let's look at my cloak situation here. Okay, so I already have that cloak. Oh, this one has leech on it, though. So, very minor upgrade. Crit verse. Hmm. I don't think these are going to be any better. I mean, these are, of course, the ones that are 200 are <laughs> the ones that I would maybe want. Hmm. I guess I'll take the cloak. Like, I don't... I should take the shoulders. But, man, I, I'm going to take the cloak. The cloak is an upgrade for my tank spec. Only because it has leech on it. So, extra 34 leech. It's literally the same cloak that I have. What terrible, uninteresting options. We'll take the cloak. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... Keys were, I found keys to be pretty rough last week. Uh, the Grievous made uh, higher keys pretty challenging on the Prides. Um, and then, you know, Fortified's always a rough DK tank week. Just getting smashed, but... This week, uh, 17 Halls of Atonement. Tyrannical, Inspiring, Necrotic, and Prideful. Also not a great DK tank week. Um... You know, necrotic. I, I guess I can always slow the ads and run away. And honestly, I don't pull, like, super big packs, typically. Kind of slow and steady is what I try to do. I try to pull big when it's appropriate, but... Um, Halls of Atonement, the, where it gets sticky, I guess, is if you get some stacks of the, uh, the dogs. And maybe they get enraged or something. And then uh, I also have necrotic stacks, so... But, I don't know. Inspiring? I, I don't think I've done Halls of Atonement on, on Inspiring, so I'm not sure how much that's going to affect. But that'll affect things from getting interrupted, but you just kind of blow them up and kind of go from there. But um, I think it's a doable key, though. Like, Halls of Atonement? I think that's a pretty doable key. But, uh, not too bad there. What is the weekly this week? Welcome. Uh, time walking. Not interested. Yeah, we uh, you know, we just did council progression last week. That's why I didn't have any raid options. I think we'll probably get it this week. Uh, we got we we got to the kind of the third phase, or the where there was just the third boss. But I think we'll probably figure it out this week uh, and kind of go from there. But yeah, pretty uh, pretty uneventful day for a chest. Kind of meh. So I don't get good stuff all the time. I just got. You know all the trinkets that i wanted already and some weapons and stuff but 
Yeah, if you guys ever want to uh, run a key or anything like that, I'm happy to help. Uh, if you just want to hit me up on Twitch, uh, I stream most nights, um, starting, you know, about 9 Eastern usually. I know that doesn't work out for a lot of people's time zones, but uh, if I'm on, I'm, I'm happy to help if I can, uh, you know, try to pump out some keys for you. But let me know. And uh, other than that, I hope everybody had better luck than me today. And... Uh, See you next time.